Okay, welcome to the channel. This is X, iPhone X, um, why I call it iPhone X, and hopefully that app will need the name and pay me a lot of money for my channel name. Yep. Okay, we're reviewing launchers. This is the first episode of our launchers review, and I'm reviewing the Zandex launcher. So developers, you know what it is. Hit me up. I will definitely review your launcher not from an expertise point of view, but from a complete um, noob point of view, where I'm just your average budget, your, your average consumer, wink. Okay, so Xandex launchers, pretty, you know, I did a little bit of tweaks here and there. Um, okay, so first of all, we got the Xandex Zen. This is where you keep, if you swipe to the left, yeah, these are all the news, my news feeds that I loaded up. We got the New York Times. We got CNN, we got BBC, and you can add more. Let me scroll to the bottom. I actually added in all these. Don't forget to subscribe and comment, guys. Come on. Come on, keep it moving. You can see I probably got two subscribers on the posting this video. Uh, what is that? 26 confictional couples that ruined love. <laughs> That's so true. Um, but when you start to love, this is where it's basically where all your news feeds go. I'm trying to go to the bottom because there's a place where you can... Oh my gosh, okay. That's giving me emotion sickness. It's good to give that up. Oh, uh, but basically you can add more. What else can we do on this Xandex launcher? It's pretty minimalistic. Here you go. This is what I kind of like about it. They color-based. White is everything. If you pick yellow, you get your yellow-based icons. Green, your green icons. Blue, your blue icons. Red, you know, red icons. Pink, purple, blah, blah. Black, your black icons. And then white is everything, basically. When you okay, scroll over. Discover. Best apps of the day. These are apps from the store. Shopping discounts. Uh, it's pretty futuristic. I really, really like it. I've been using it for a few days now. Then we have... Let's go over. Oops. Oh, yeah. You can also just scroll up. Then we have games. You have per your personalization apps. Your tools. Your productivity apps. Socials. Customize. Car category. So this is where you add, remove. Uh, lots of tweaking there. So let's take away personalization, tools... Uh, let's leave games. You can also just take away the discovery tabs completely and let's add music media and Finance let's add finance to see what we got there. See? So we got finance music media videos stuff like that So that's for the app jar. Um What else can you do on this? Let's see when you hit the ads, you know the iOS 8 uh, what I like too, you can also uninstall, remove. You know, that's a pretty new feature. Okay, what do we got here? Let's tap on and see some of the settings. Personalizations, wallpapers, widgets, themes, your icon style. Let's see icon style. See this where you can download your icon packs. So we can kick classic and they show you a little preview up at the top. Square, that, modern, all right, so I like this. Like this, the one that it defaults with, but let's, let me see how that one looks. We can add your widgets, built-ins, BlackBerry launcher widgets, because I'm using this on my BlackBerry key one. Um, wallpapers. Okay, is it going to show the wallpapers that it comes with? Or is it going to show, yeah, pretty much. Wallpapers that it comes with, the phone, that, but then you have your phone gallery, and you have your live wallpapers. So let's look at colors oh these are just basically bland hues okay let's go back you can manage your home screens basically what's what here you can add infinity scroll okay let's add infinity scroll let's add infinity scroll you can grid to see how much icons fit on a page um, transition effects how it looks from page to page Smooth, let's change that to zoom. I think I'll try zoom. Okay, others, clock and weather widget. You can change that. You can change your search engine. You can change your notifications, phone seconds, app recommendations. And that's pretty much all you can do with the launcher. Let's see how Infinity Scroll works. Yeah, doesn't look too bad. It's pretty nice. So you got your search up there, voice, um, voice mod. So, so far, the Yandex launcher is... Aside from the next launcher that I'm going to be reviewing, which is the computer launcher, the Xandex launcher is basically my second favorite. So let me know what you guys think. Comment in the comment section below what launches you want to see. I believe that 
having an Android or having an iPhone has become so the same, blah, blah. You need to find... The only one up I give Android is the fact that you can change your layout and customize a little. So let me know what you guys think. What do you guys want to see done? And you know what it is. It's triple X, X, X. Yeah, you see that. Uh, oh, cute wall drop of the day. Um, Let's go. Let's, this is another app I'm going to be re reviewing, but let's, let me just... Let me just quickly change my wallpaper. This is Backdrops. Uh, one of my favorite, one of the best um, wallpaper apps. So, you know what it is. Don't forget to subscribe, guys. And I'm out.